You know, yesterday I heard the president give a big speech about Biden economics. You know, the core of good economics for America is to become energy independent. What's it mean to be energy independent? It lowers the price. It lowers inflation. It lets Americans keep more money in their pocket. But it also means jobs. I look to the men and women behind me. These are good paying jobs. But it makes America stronger and it makes the world a safer place. And environmentally, it makes us more sound. When you look at what's produced out of these fields, the oil and the gas, if we simply replenish and change just Russia natural gas in Europe for one year, if we replaced it with American natural gas, we would cut 218 million tons of CO2 emissions. Our natural gas is 41% cleaner than theirs. So not only would Europe be safer politically, the world would be environmentally safer. I watched the way, you could applaud that, that's important. I like it. It's ever starting. But what is happening, I happen to be from California. We have the ability in my county to produce a lot of oil. This is the difference between Ohio and California and who's looking out for America. In California, they've reduced production by 20%. Not because we don't have the oil and gas to produce, but because the governor is shutting down the permitting to allow us to continue to produce. So that's 80,000 barrels a day that California doesn't produce. Do we use 80,000 barrels less? No. So you know what Gavin Newsom does? He's been buying 50,000 barrels a day from Putin, who uses that money to go kill innocent people in Ukraine. What does Ohio do? They discover new fields, safe, secure, environmentally sound, produce new oil and natural gas by Americans, for Americans. The steel all produced in Ohio, producing more American jobs, making America stronger, Ohio stronger. This is the difference of good politics, of good policy. God has blessed America with resources. If we have the ability to produce those resources, America will be stronger and the world will be safer. We shouldn't just think of the natural gas that God has blessed us with, not just to make America energy independent, because it's so abundant we should sell it to our allies and our adversaries. How much safer would the world be if China was dependent on American natural gas? We'd be environmentally better, we'd be economically stronger, and the world would be a safer place to live. So for those who are working out here, for those who are drilling the rigs, welding the pipe, and producing the oil and natural gas. For America, I thank you. It's a tough job. But I want you to know as policymakers, we appreciate the work you do, and we're gonna make it easier for you to do your job. You know, we just passed this bill regarding the debt ceiling, and something you need to know that's in it. There is a natural gas pipeline that had to go to the Supreme Court three times. 92% almost done, we finished it. A lot of natural gas from Ohio is gonna go into that pipeline and also from Pennsylvania to go to Americans' home to lower their costs. We also have in there environmental review reform. NEPA hasn't been reformed in 40 years. Don't you get frustrated when you wanna produce something but the red tape lasts for years and years? We narrowed it so it can only be one or two years to study it because we want America to reach all of its potential. America's too great of a nation not to. And all Americans will benefit from that.